Thank you very much. Uh, yes, very nice to be back in Montreal. This is actually my uh, 30th year as a professional comedian. Thank you. How I got into comedy was kind of weird. What happened was I witnessed a gangland slaying, needed a place to hide, and I thought, Canadian showbiz. They'll never find me here. Actually, things are going pretty well. Uh, in fact, I think we can all see by this graph. <laughs> I got rollerblade. They move. Oh, man. You can cover a lot of ground. I find they mostly cover it with bits of skin. <laughs> and they wear the helmet, too. It's not the law. Well, it's sort of the law. It's one of those ironic life laws, you know? Then in order to avoid brain damage, you have to look like you already have it. <laughs> I am brain damaged, I swear. I can't remember anything ever learned in high school. Just a complete blank. Math, completely gone. In fact, they did a survey. They found out one in four people cannot do basic math. So we know this statistic is probably wrong. Uh, world's changing, uh, big changes. It's the information age. Oh, that's all I know about it. <laughs> Are you on the net? Oh, you have to be. It's the marketing push of all time. Get on the net. Everyone's on the net, but you, what a big loser. You are not on the net. Think about it, really. Would you be in a big hurry if they were screaming, get in the net? Come on, fish. Get on the net. We're not going to catch you. I'm on the net. Yes, just for the articles. I, I eat too damn much. That's what I love to eat. Oh, boy. Eating and sleeping are my two favorite. Oh, yeah. Oh, I like to eat just enough. To get tired. Huh? Sleep just enough to get hungry. Keep a nice rhythm going there. I eat too damn much. I'm not even hungry half the time. I eat for sport. Huh? We do this. Are you hungry? No. Could you eat? Sure. Been eating a lot of those uh, vegetarian burgers. I, uh, yeah, I like to have a vegetarian burger and then follow that with a regular burger so that that burger will have something to eat as well. So I'm not married. If you are married, good for you. It's just, what is it? One in three marriages ends in divorce now? Huh? And the other two? Murder, suicide. <laughs> it's different. It's different mindsets. That's the problem, you know? Women get married as all these factors, you know, romance, security, sex, all rolled into... But guys can separate, you know, love and sex. Two different cities, if necessary. <laughs> I'm kidding. I love her. And I travel. <laughs> well, thank you very much. You're, you're a lovely group. You know, because I'm getting older, and uh, I, I don't want to be all sappy about it, but I find as I'm getting older, I'm starting to ask myself certain questions that maybe you don't think about when you're younger, but as you get older, you feel the need to, you know, why am I here? <laughs> Not in a spiritual sense, just standing in the basement. Why am I here? What did I come down here for? I was, I was up and I was doing a thing and I needed a something and I came down and I was... Do you remember pre-approved credit? That you would get those letters? You know what a pre-approved credit card basically says? It says, uh, we've been watching you and you spend money like an idiot. We'd like to help. 
We think with a little encouragement, you could spend even more money. You're our kind of people. Credit is the problem, though, because when you pay cash for something, you know, there's a connection to it, right? You reach into your wallet, you take out, it's physical. You watch it. You watch the money as you're handing it over. That seems like a lot for one dance. Hey. Are you, are you Harry Potter fans? Oh, oh. Has anyone been to the... It, it's called the Harry Potter Experience at Universal Studios. What, isn't it? Oh. It's the most amazing... I wouldn't even call it a ride. It's like a 3D projection. Emerge, like You feel like you are flying. It is absolutely amazing. And the most incredible part is at the end of the ride, you go through the gift shop <laughs> where they will sell you a magic wand for $30 US. And it doesn't do anything. It's a piece of crap in a cardboard box. There's no picture. It's not signed. There's no magic tricks, nothing. $30 US. And here's the kicker. There is a different wand for every single character in the movie. And you see people with armloads of, well, I should get a Hermione and a Harry if I'm going to defeat Voldemort. I guess I probably should have a Snape in reserve, but a Dumbledore is the more powerful, so I'm not really sure. Yeah. And I'm watching this, and I'm losing my mind. I am losing my mind, because everybody knows the wand chooses you. <laughs> That's it for me, Montreal. Thank you very much. Good night.